Cyborg Santos, a late replacement against Brennan Ward in Brennan Ward's hometown. All eyes were on Brennan Ward. Everybody knew he was one, maybe two fights away from a title shot. He looked devastating, 170 pounds. Cyborg Santos, a guy who'd been in the game forever and fought some of the best names in the world, but a lot of people were looking past him in this fight. In the opening minute, when Brennan Ward got the waist cinch around him and he rolls for that leg lock, I knew it was big trouble for Brennan Ward. That was a very, very tight heel look. It was exactly the way you're supposed to do it. And it's such a dangerous submission. It doesn't hurt until the last second, until it's almost too late. And as soon as he locked it up, I knew he had Brennan Ward in big trouble. This is a guy, a black belt in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, real submission skills, who said, I never used them. I never got a chance to show everybody what I have on the ground. This was his opportunity in so many ways and he made the most of it. That's what a veteran does. We knew he could bang, we knew he had kickboxing skills, we knew he had great Muay Thai. Could he outlast a younger, stronger, more athletic guy with his technique? Yes, he could. That's exactly what he showed against Brendan Moore.